Good evening. Uh, I would like to say congratulations to all of you uh, the athletes, too. I started uh, coaching high school in 1971. I coached the B team. That would be like uh, your freshman or sophomore, some kind of combination. Uh, and I thought I would do it the rest of my life because I enjoyed every minute of it. I got an opportunity to coach at different levels after that and moved up, but I always said one of the uh, most satisfying times I ever had was coaching the sophomores at uh, Glendale High School in, in California. How about that? Uh, your coach, Coach Marty Ellis, and I uh, met, uh, this must have been in uh, like 97 or 98, somewhere around there, at uh, Point Loma Nazarene University. Marty was uh, one of our uh, recruits and uh, came in and, and uh, just uh, was amazing, probably like he is now, with uh, his enthusiasm and hard work. Uh, he just worked really hard and was really enthusiastic and, and really a happy guy to be around. We, we really enjoyed it. He needed an extra class uh, uh, at one point and he came to me and I had an independent study class uh, and I assigned him to uh, research John Wooden's Pyramid of Success. Uh, and uh, in our phone conversation right before this, he referred to that as kind of a defining moment in his life, uh, and maybe in his coaching uh, career. Uh, and I didn't know it had that much effect on him, but it, it, I think it really has. He's probably preached it some to you guys uh, uh, also. Uh, the heart of that pyramid, uh, there's three words. I've always remembered them, and I've made them the heart of my coaching, uh, too. Uh, the heart, if you haven't memorized it, memorize it. Fundamentals, teamwork, and conditioning. Fundamentals, teamwork, and conditioning. I've had the privilege of meeting Coach uh, John Wooden uh, several times, and uh, uh, sat and watched a few games with him sometimes, uh, and uh, every time he said, he said, Bill, Bill, just remember, Fundamentals, fundamentals, every day, fundamentals. I watched UCLA work out for the uh, national championship a uh, couple of uh, hours before they were going to play. He did 45 minutes of fundamentals, uh, passing, catching, pivoting, uh, stops, turns, body balance. Uh, that, that was John Wood. So don't get tired of the, fu of the fundamentals. And teamwork, uh, uh, it's a team sport. There's three great sports in the world, according to me. Uh, there's uh, basketball, because it's a team sport. Uh, there's tennis, because it's me against you. i got to make you look bad to make me look good. And then there's golf, which I'm doing a lot of now, and that's just me against me. <laughs> so it's kind of three different types of, uh, of competitions, uh, and all of you are in involved in basketball uh, right now. Now, when I was young, I, I'm... Uh, I'm still, uh, I'm not, I'm old. <laughs> I'm not, uh, but, but when I was young, I used to have a t-shirt that said, basketball is life. And I want to tell you guys something, that's wrong. Basketball is not life. I've learned that it's part of life. If I were today to have a, 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 a shirt, I might say, uh, life is about relationships. Life is about relationships. And according to the period of success, fundamentals, teamwork, conditioning, John Wooden meant more than just physical condition. He meant it mental, moral, physical, uh, spiritual condition. And I think, first of all, uh, life is about a relationship with God. I think you need to develop a relationship with God. Both John Locke and I uh, uh, came to know God in our lives as sophomores in college. And, and, and we both had a lot of experience for the last 50 years of basketball. But I tell, us, tell you that that relationship with God has been more important and has carried us through more circumstances than basketball ever would. Then the other, I think, uh, relationships with people, with your family, with your friends, and with your teammates. John and I have been friends. This is scary because I'm... Uh, I'm now 73. Uh, we've been friends for over 55 years. Wow. Uh, and it started in the basketball court uh, over uh, in, in, uh, in 
and down the beach where I, where I used to live. And, and our friendship grew and we decided to go to the same college together, USC. We were best men at each other's wedding. He's moved around, I moved around. But that relationship has lasted. I couldn't tell you anything about my college career or my high school career. Uh, it's kind of a, a vague. But relationships uh, with God and with my friends have what has what it has made my life worthwhile. And I would just encourage you to, to love basketball. It's really important, but it's just part of life, and, and your relationships are much greater. Thank you. Thank you.